Welcome to sip9.com. In this video, we will prove that then that the sum of the interior angles of a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. You know? So, uh, before natin improve, I, I discuss muna natin yung mga concepts na gagamitin natin sa proof. Ano? So, yung unang concept is the concept of uh, alternate interior angles. Ano? Sa parallel postulate, uh, sinasabi na if two uh, lines or line segments are parallel, cut by a transversal, then the in alternate interior angles are congruent. Ano? So, pag sinabi natin alternate interior, So this this is one pair of alternate interior angles. Interior alternate kasi nandoon siya sa alternate sides ng ng uh, transversal, nasa left yung isa yung nasa right. And interior kasi nasa interior siya nung uh, parallel lines ano or parallel line segments. Okay, so that's one pair of alternate interior angles ano. This is another pair. Okay? Okay, so ibig sabihin niyan yung yung angles na to are congruent, yung dalawang angles na to yung red. And then, yung uh, dalawang angles na rin na to, they are alternate interior angles, so they are also congruent. Okay. So, yung pangalawang concept is a concept of straight angles. Ano? So, meron kang ang pag meron kang angle na yung dalawang sides mo ay on a straight line, so this is the first side, and this is the second side. So, you are Pag merong dalawang, uh, if they are on a straight line, straight line, then they are straight angles and they, their measure is 180 degrees. Okay? So using those, uh, these two, these two uh, concepts, ipoprove na natin that the sum of the interior angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. Okay? We'll start with the straight line. And then... Straight line segment. By the way, pag sinabi ko pala sa line or line segment, interchangeable muna tayo. Ano? Agreement lang natin yan dito sa proof na to, ano? And then, lalagay ko siya dito sa B. Ano? And this segment is parallel to this line segment. Ano? So, pwede yan kasi given a line, given a line segment or a line and a point, ang point natin dito B, you can always draw a line parallel to that segment and passing through a certain that passing through a particular point at the, in this case ano no yung point b so parallel itong dalawang ito so based on uh, the concept of uh, alternate interior angles and the concept of um, parallel postulate dito nakaform tayo ng uh, straight angle ano so, this angle, pangalan na natin ang angle 1. And then, this angle, pangalan na natin ang angle 2. And this angle, pangalan na natin ang, ng angle 3. Actually, form straight angle, ano? So, straight line. Straight line siya, eh. So, ibig sabihin, measure of angle 1, plus uh, measure of angle 2 plus measure of angle 3 is equal to 180 degrees. No. No. Definition na yun, ano? Ng straight angle. So by definition. Next, um, kung titignan natin yung, yung, yung uh, parallel postulate, pag in-extend natin to, kapareho siya nito, no? Pag in-extend natin yung AC sa kaliwa, at yung BA, transversal siya. So, ibig sabihin, alternate interior angles, yung angle 1 at saka angle A ay alternate interior angles, ano? So, ano ibig sabihin niyan? So, measure of angle 1 is congruent, oh sorry, equal, 
is equal to measure. Siya doon mababa. Is equal to measure of angle A. Ano? Next. Yung angle 3 at angle C are also alternate interior angles. Ano? Kasi pag in-extend ko naman yung AC dito, yung BA, in -extend, ay yung BC, in-extend ko, this also becomes a transversal. Ano? So, magiging alternate interior din yung angle 3 at angle C. No? Tama? So, measure of angle 3 is equal to measure of angle C, you know? This is by, um, these two are by the alternate interior angle, you know? Because they are alternate interior angle. New reasons. Or your reason, you know? Next. Measure of angle 2 is equal to measure of angle A, B, C, no? This is actually by, actually this is by reflexive property, ano? Sabi na an angle is, pareho lang naman yun, no? Pag sinabi kong angle to, well, I'm actually referring to angle uh, A, B, C, ano? So this is, Sorry, this is ABC. So this is by reflexive property. An angle is equal to itself, ano? or is congruent to itself. By reflexive property. So I review nyo na lang to, to, to reflexive property, and hindi man natin yung discuss dito. Ano? So by substitution, Pinaka final final equation natin is measure ang measure of angle 1 dito sa i substitute natin yung mga ito dito sa equation na to no? yung mga nasa right hand side so dahil equal sila eh so measure of angle 1 pwede nating gawing measure of angle a you know? and then plus measure of angle 2 pwede nating gawing measure of angle abc Plus, ang measure of angle 3, pwede natin gawing measure of angle C. Oh, hindi na na tayo masyadong stricto dito sa sign kasi wala tayong time. Ano? But bukas siyang less than it. It's 180 degrees. No? But what are these measures? These are the measures of the interior angle of a triangle, di ba? The measure of angle A, measure of angle A, B, C, and measure of angle C are actually measure of the interior angles of triangle. Yeah? But, pwede natin sabihin, but, but angle A, angle ABC, and angle C are interior angles. Of a triangle. Therefore, pinaka conclusion natin, the sum of the interior, siguro of the triangle, of the triangle above, triangle above, no? therefore the sum of the interior angles. of a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. So the proof, the proof above actually concerns all triangles dahil 
pag, pag gumawa ka ng triangle, di ba? Any triangle. Gumawa ko ng triangle na ganito, no? no? I can always choose a base, ano? Kung, kung gagawin ko itong base, anong gagawa ko ng parallel line dun sa base, ano? I can choose all. I can always choose one. Uh, one of the sides as base. And then I can always draw a line parallel to the to that base. And I can always use this this theorem no? of the, this sequence of statements to prove that, that it is indeed the triangle is indeed equal to or the angle sum of the triangle is indeed equal to 180 degrees. Actually, um, of course, kung, kung may knowledge kayo sa proof, kung may notion kayo na proof, you would know that this proof is enough no? to show that the uh, sum of the interior angles of a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. Okay, maraming salamat and I hope meron kayong natutunan.